You experienced racism. Why didn't you walk away? That's a really good question. You're a politician. I'm not, you read I'm the not polls. a politician. I don't read the polls. Yeah, you I are sit in judiciary committee. No, you are, you are I very do. definitely I a politician. No, no, no. The very fact that there were not people I'm who getting... looked like you. The... In... Hold on. I'm only halfway through my answer. Is secret schooling happening across Afghanistan for girls? It does. You simply actually, can't assume that. Actually, yes, you can. Hard talk. Watch on BBC iPlayer. This time on Weatherworld, heat, drought and fire. I'll have the story of a record-breaking summer. And I'll be talking to the scientists whose near real-time analysis shows how climate change has supercharged this summer's weather extremes. Weatherworld. Watch on BBC iPlayer. This is BBC News with the latest headlines for viewers in the UK and around the world. I'm Lucy Gray. Final hour of voting in Italy. The country could choose its first female prime minister. I'm Mark Lowen, live in Rome, where we'll soon find out if Italy has swung behind its first far-right leader since Mussolini. The Iranian president threatens decisive action to stop the wave of anti-government protests sweeping the country. Houses are washed into the sea as Storm Fiona batters the east coast of Canada. And the BBC goes behind the scenes of America's spy agency as the CIA marks its 75th anniversary. Welcome to BBC News. Italians have just one hour left to vote in a general election that could see the country choose its most right-wing government since the Second World War and pave the way for Giorgia Meloni to become Italy's first woman prime minister. A right-wing alliance led by her Brothers of Italy party appeared set for a clear victory when the last opinion polls were published two weeks ago. Let's cross live now to Mark, to Mark Lowen, who is in Rome for us. Over to you, Mark. Lucy, thank you very much indeed. Yes, the last hour of voting before polls close and before an exit poll will come out, which will suggest whether or not 